A large crowd of stranded passengers milled around the scene of the incident. According to some eyewitnesses, the petrol tanker was trying to avoid a bad spot on the road when it fell and spilled its contents. They said a car that was trying to maneuver through the bad spot got stuck and in an attempt to start the engine, it ignited fire, killing the passengers and other cars instantly. Those trying to scoop petrol were not spared in the inferno that ensued, as one died instantly and other escaped with severe burns. Until they come, the road was bad. There was hold up. So they tried to maneuver as he put leg for ground immediately. Gradually, gradually, that's what the trailer just for. So as he fall, the driver managed to come down, go corner. So people came, they were now stabbing the fuel. Immediately, the place catch fire. People inside the motor, they don't, they don't feel come outside, they burn inside the motor. Almost three cars there, people they inside, they burn. Made the government try to help us. We're not able to talk about employment now. Road, what will go past? Not still day. If you look the condition of the road from uh, Ologbodan to this Coco Junction, every day we record a falling tanker. If you look both sides of the road, it's not motorable. If we sell Logbona, where people take uh, another alternative now, the whole place is no more, it's not motorable again. We beg government, federal government of this country, they should look into our way. We are suffering this road. If you check now, today is the market day. The normal cocoa market. They should try and do something. This, if, if, if you can observe now, the people that is occurring in this accident are people going to the market. The situation is very, very terrible. It's a surprise that uh, something of this nature happened. Almost uh, how many hours now? And solution has not been found to it. As even the, the, the road is good, all this incident will not happen. No, no, no. Now, if you go to that area now, as far from Coco, Coco Junction, to that side, no way to go. We have people, we people going to Patakos now. We don't know the time to get there. We are begging government, government, federal government, come and help us. People are dying here. The number of deaths could not be immediately ascertained. Meanwhile, travelers were stranded for several hours. Fire truck from Delta State later arrived after residents of the area and travelers managed to bring the situation under control. Pius Nsogo reporting.